Reporting San Diego, I'm Ron Burgundy, and this is your Channel 5 News. Now over to you, Brick. Ron, my legs! My legs! Brick, they're gone! Brick, come down! Brick, they're gone! Brick, you're in Brick, they're gone! Brick, you're in front of the box, Brick. Come down, Brick, Brick. Brick, get off the floor. Get off the field they're position, gone. Brick. Brick, your legs are still there. Legs, they're gone! Good morning, Lions. Welcome to Thursday's edition of Assumption Television. I'm your host, Tara. And I'm Chloe. The final roster for the boys' baseball team has now been determined. The coaches would like to thank all the boys that tried out for the team. Weather permitting, there will be practices this week after school at Lions Park on Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Players need to see Mr. Anir in Portable 1 at either first or second lunch on Monday in order to be fitted for the uniforms and to select their jersey numbers so that their uniforms can be ready for our first game on May the 1st. Our track and field meet will be Tuesday, April 28th with a rain date of Wednesday, April 29th. That is next week. Sign-ups for both boys and girls can be found posted outside the Girls Fizet office door. Please come to the gym area and sign up today. Come on, Lions, let's have some new ACS records. Art Club with Miss Christy will meet Tuesday, April 28th. Girls Baseball Tryouts will be today, Monday, today, Monday, April 27th, Tuesday, April 28th, and Thursday, April 30th at 3.30 at Sir Thomas More Park next to Lions Park. Please bring your own equipment. Every voice counts. All students, please participate via the link that was emailed to your Outlook inbox. This is a chance to make a difference. Here's another opportunity for creative writers, the James Bartleman Aboriginal Creative Writing Awards. The award is named after the Honorable James Bartleman, who is the 27th Lieutenant Governor of Ontario, serving from 2002 to 2007, and was the first Aboriginal Lieutenant Governor of Ontario. The award was set up as a legacy to his efforts in promoting literacy among Aboriginal youth. Every year, up to six Aboriginal students each receive the award of $2,500. The deadline for submission is May 31st. See Ms. Fergus for the criteria and submission information. Attention Lions, STEM wants to invite you to try out our problem of the week. With weekly prizes and puzzles that will challenge students in any grade, we look forward to a great year of problems. Come out and grab a copy of this week's problem of Room 3011. Midnight Movie Marathon at, Gal at Galaxy Cinema Brantford on Friday 24th. Doors open at 11.45 p.m. and finish at 6 a.m. Free pop, popcorn, and free arcade all night long. Tickets are $25. Advanced online tickets are cash at the door. Fundraiser for Kids Can Fly. Attention concert band, vocal ensemble, and intermediate band. If you want to be part of the Festival of Music at Canada's Wonderland in May, you need to get a permission form. Pick up one from Miss Lynn Davies or Miss Radle Band in the music room. There's limited room on the trip, so bring your money and permission form in today. <laughs> All participants who are registered in who are registered in the Brantford Classic this Sunday, please come down to the gym at the beginning of lunch for a very brief meeting. Caffeine and big dreams, there's no better combination. Come out to our annual springtime coffee house tonight to enjoy some excellent entertainment and delicious treats. $10 at the door, you don't want to miss out. Attention all Schism Health and Wellness students. Pick up your permission forms for the University of Waterloo Cadaver Lab from Miss Farrell in room 36, 36 period one or outside room 2064. These forms are due Wednesday, April 29th. Please be aware that the elite presentation by Mr. Kyle Christie has been rescheduled for one day earlier than on the posters. It is now Thursday, April 30th, still in the lecture hall and still during both lunches. The boys baseball practice scheduled for today has been canceled. Practices will resume Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. Boys soccer practice resumes on Monday after school in the upper field. Game one is rescheduled is scheduled on Wednesday at 4 o'clock at WIFO. With everyone's help, we were able to plant about 400 trees yesterday, even in the hailstorm. Nothing stopped the lions. Thank you to our students who participated and to all of our staff who helped to make the tree planting such a success. Babies' lives need to be protected, and teenage moms need to be loved and supported. Join us May 14th at the Ottawa March for Life. See Mr. Bissonnette to find out how. Today, we have Chef Corbin Day, Turkey Mushroom Penne. Like us on Facebook. That's all we have for you today, Lions. Now over to Coffee House promo. Don't forget to buy your tickets.